Welcome to part two of how acoustic guitar is made at McKee Guitars. Um, what you see here is two halves of a top of a guitar and this is a Adirondack Spruce. It's quarter sawn and book matched and this jig that you see that it's laying on is a jig in this bar here is uh, got sandpaper on it and you use it to straighten out the seam there and then you glue and join the two pieces together and you get a pretty tight you gotta get a pretty tight seam there so it'll hold but uh, trees aren't really big enough to be um, to be one piece for a guitar so you have to do uh, two book match pieces to uh, make a top and that it goes that way for sides also and uh, or for the back rather um, so that's what they look like before they're joined together here's the rope clamps here that clamp the two pieces together and you really can't see the seam at all you have to you have to look for it real close to even find the seam but they're book matched so it looks like all one piece so that's the next step after you cut out the braces. We thin them down a little bit, get them book matched and uh, glued together. And then these simple rope clamps um, glue them together just fine. They don't usually come apart. Um, I've never had one come apart. And it's a very effective, easy way to glue them together. Very simple clamps to make. Um, as you can see, it's nothing fancy. Um, you can just um, make them on your own. You don't even have to buy them. Um, and also, too, the jig for sanding that joint is very simple and basic. And it's not real high tech or anything. So that's the next step. And then, then once they're joined, um, my thickness sanding machine here, it... Um, it puts the thickness to my top and back plates and the sides and saves me a whole lot of time in sanding and uh, once I get them joined together I'll run them through there and even up the seam and then I will inlay the rosette on the top and uh, then I'll take the top down to its final thickness and this rosette will be sanded flush through that also, too, the, the back will be final thickness sanded after it comes out of the clamps. It will be cut out to its shape it's going to be and get ready for uh, the braces to be glued on. So uh, look for part number three, which would be um, either bracing up the back or inlaying the rosette. I haven't figured that part out yet, what I'm going to do next for the video. But uh, be sure to keep tuned in on my YouTube channel and also on Facebook I'll be posting these videos so you can you can find them on Facebook it's McKee Guitars on Facebook uh, my website's mckeeguitars.com so thanks for watching